Hi, I'm Colin from HDCCTV. In this video, I'm just going to quickly run through how to operate the NVRs. Okay, so first of all, how to add the device to the software. Go to Device Manage and click New Device and then the Search button. That will find any, any recorders on the network. And the one we're looking for here is 10.0.0.59, which is the last one on the list there. So we'll click on that and click Choose. And then we're just going to rename that as NVR1 so we know which device it is. Okay, and then click on save and that adds it to the, the list there. You'll see the little red cross means it's offline. As soon as it comes online, there we go, it's online again now. You can now rename the camera channels if you wish, so you know which cameras are which. There we go. Okay, now to, uh, now to watch your cameras live, you go to the preview button and you'll see the device on the left there. So you click the plus button and you literally drag and drop the cameras into the viewing window. We'll just drop four in here for now. Okay, you see the bottom right hand corner of the screen we've got various screen modes. We can have single, four, five, six, nine, up to 64 screens on the, uh, on the monitor at one time. Okay, so now to play back some recordings, you go to the um, the playback button at the bottom right hand corner of each window. There's a little triangle button. You hit that one to bring up the playback screen, and then hit the search button once you've checked the right uh, the right date is there, and you'll see a, a timeline across the bottom in blue, and you can click along that to uh, view recordings for the whole day. Now, if you need to back up your recordings to get evidence to the police, for example. You'd stop the playback and hit the video download button, select the start and end time of the uh, data you want to back up, and then hit the start button. That then downloads it to your computer. OK, that's done. So we'll now go and um, have a look at the file. We'll just navigate to the, um, the file itself. And you see it stored the file in Drive D, Plat Data, Video Clip. So we can now insert the CD-ROM that came with the recorder, navigate to the Player folder, and then we should be able to view that file. So if you run the DVR player, and then open the file from that folder, And there we go, there's the, the file we backed up playing back. Okay, thanks for watching. I'm Colin from HDCCTV.